Hi folks, this is your Emrys fleeting view for the week ahead. Now Monday is looking a classically British bank holiday I'm afraid, with extensive rain, some brisk winds and low cloud across the hills as well. That wind touching gale force in places on the highest tops, especially through Wales at times in the morning across northern England. For Scotland the rain will tend to pull eastwards but some heavy showers follow from the west. Here's the sequence through the day then, and first thing in the morning, the heaviest rain is through southern Scotland into England and Wales, and pretty wet too across much of central and western parts of the highlands. The rain patchier further north and east, and across much of the highlands it will tend to break up through the morning, leaving just uh, dregs of rain across some central and eastern areas. Some patchy rain too at times in western areas, particularly around sky, drier towards the far northeast, where there'll be some breaks in the cloud. Some heavy showers though around, possibly into the afternoon, and those running in across from Northern Ireland into southwest Scotland, the odd thundery burst is possible late afternoon into the evening. Some heavy rain may persist across South Wales. This chart shows it clearing quite well through the afternoon, but it may well be that some heavier rain tries to come back in again across the southern half of Wales at least. Further pulses of rain continue overnight into Tuesday, those moving eastwards as we go into Tuesday daytime. Tuesday itself then is a day of sunshine and scattered showers. One or two of those on the heavy side though, and locally a chance of rumble of thunder. Those will be tending to focus towards more eastern regions of the highlands through the later part of the afternoon. One or two passing eastwards across England and Wales, but also a good amount of dry and bright weather. The wind fairly light, but will feel cool where exposed on higher terrain. Into Wednesday and we'll have low pressure nearby and areas of rain and showers a bit more widespread through the day on Wednesday. Western Scotland looking pretty wet with rain on and off much of the day. Some heavier and showery bursts getting going more widely as time goes on and through the afternoon the risk of a rumble of thunder again in places. More widely across the highlands but a scattering of heavy showers quite likely through England and Wales as well. A windier day too and again feeling rather cool across the tops. Later in the week, and we're still broadly influenced by low pressure, it looks as though the centre is a little bit further southwards, with showers more focused across Wales, perhaps a scattering through northern England, one or two through the highlands, but it may be a drier day overall here, with showers more focused towards the south and west of Scotland through the afternoon. Some sunny spells coming through, feeling cool though again, temperatures only just above freezing on the highest Scottish summits, but the wind fairly light for most. Need to watch the timing by Friday because although there is a ridge of high pressure just moving in through England and Wales, there's the possibility of some fronts sweeping in from the Atlantic towards west and northwest Scotland as the day goes on. Here the wind likely to strengthen and the risk of some rain and lowering cloud. But away from that, for eastern Scotland, for England and Wales, may well be a drier and brighter day with rare, if any, showers. Temperatures just a touch higher as well. The early indications into next weekend are looking pretty unsettled for many places once more. We shall look at that detail and the longer range outlook in the next video on Tuesday. Thanks for watching today's fleeting view. Bye for now.